BTRFS partitioning on Linux Mint 19.2 Welcome to installing Linux Mint on a UFI machine and partitioning the HDD as BTRFS. What is BTRFS? BTRFS is a modern copy on write, cow, file system for Linux aimed at implementing advanced features while also focusing on fault tolerance, repair, and easy administration. Jointly developed at multiple companies, BTRFS is licensed under the GPL and open for contribution from anyone. Let's get started. Boot from DVD or USB Linux Mint Installer Press Enter to boot from DVD or USB When Linux Mint Installer has completed boot to desktop click on the icon Install Linux Mint. This will bring up the start of install dialog box. Choose preferred language and continue. Choose Keyboard Layout and continue. Prefer not to install third-party software. Press Continue. On the Installation Type dialog box. Select something else. This will bring up the Device, Type, Mount Point, Format, Size, and System box. Where you can choose where to install Linux Mint OS. When you click Install. The installer may ask you for an EFI system partition. Otherwise, it may not boot successfully. Click Go Back and create a 1GB partition for EFI after the BTRFS partition. To do this click on the free space below the BTRFS partition and click the plus button. This will bring another dialog box where you can choose size and choose mount point as EFI. The installer will ask you to confirm to continue to write the changes to disk. Click Continue. Confirm you location and hit Continue. Type your name, the computer's name, pick a username. Choose a password and confirm you password. Strong passwords are a mix of alphanumeric characters and numbers and must be above 8 digits. The installation starts and you can grab your cup of coffee and wait for the installer to finish. This may take up to 10 or more minutes depending on the specs of your machine. When the installation is complete, you will be required to restart your computer or continue testing Linux Mint. Click Restart Now. If you liked this video, please don't forget to click on the subscribe button below.